Deckard Mayor Robin Smith may think twice about taking another sick day. He missed the last meeting and Vice Mayor Carl Smith won enough support to terminate employee the mayor had just hired. Hello everyone, I'm Dick Wolf with this Buzz Moment. Mayor Smith hired Rex Clark, one of his employees at Big Daddy's Sports Wear and Gear Store, to coordinate uses of city parks and recreation areas. City Administrator Mike Foster told us that. Clark was to work during the park season, roughly March through Labor Day, for which he would be paid $200 per month to handle requests from the public for use of Hank Weddington Park, the Babe Ruth baseball field, and softball fields. Foster said he and Mike St. John at the Deckard Street Department had been handling reservations for the two parks, but there were conflicts when multiple teams showed up to use the same field. And there were also times that users forgot to turn out the lights, earning the wrath of neighbors and adding unnecessary costs to the city. He said the mayor wanted more organization on the city side to keep track of users and keys used not only to access the parks, but the lighting. The city does not charge for park use, even if the users are not residents or taxpayers of the city. But Carl Smith had a different point of view, saying the board was not consulted for the hire, there was no public posting that the job was available, and it was not in the budget. So in the mayor's absence, Vice Mayor Smith won support from Alderman Ray Parton, excuse me, Roy Parton, and Don Cofer to terminate Clark. Alderman Jimmy Wayne Sanders abstained. Foster says there were funds available in the general fund for the hire, but not listed as a line item. Foster also noted the city board will hear a proposal to develop a fee structure for use of recreation facilities at its meeting in September. We contacted Mayor Smith about providing comments on this story, but he did not respond. But my guess is we haven't heard the last of this. For The Buzz, I'm Dick Wolf.